So what we need to know first is what's in the news? What I need from you is a newsworthy headline from a newspaper. Something silly. I'm going to give you some examples, and these are real examples from actual newspapers. Things like Catford Fox Horror for Man on Toilet or Jellyfish, jellyfish Apocalypse Not Coming. They were actual headlines, <laughs> genuine headlines from the newspapers. So I need something like that from you. Give me a headline. What do you think? Giant oh. banana kills thousands. I mean, that's absolutely. Did anyone else have uh, anything else for other than I'm loving that? So let's. I think we're just going with Jai Banana Kills Thousands, aren't we? Yeah. Okay, so our first scene is going to see the journalists turning up and getting the story. So, um, Tom, you are going to be the journalist. You want to find out all the goss. Eddie. You are our star witness, and Chris, you are a bystander. What I want to see you unfold in the next few minutes is the story of this awful, awful tragedy of this banana that's killed thousands of people. Why? How? Give me the news. Are you ready, chaps? Yeah. Okay. What's in the news? <laughs> so, uh, I, I hear you were the, uh, the witness to the, uh, the incident. What the, the thing that happened here? Yeah? Oh yes, yeah, I'm sorry. I was stood there, and I saw the whole thing. It was horrible. <laughs> so, uh, so can you tell me, like, uh, you know, like, obviously yeah. there's, there seems to be thousands of dead people there's, here. There's, what happened? What happened? There's just a cow of crates with all of the dead people in it, and it's uh, upsetting. <laughs> I can, I can see that it is very upsetting, sir, but what I need you to do is calm down and oh, tell me your own words. Exactly what happened to those poor goddamn people in that hole? Well, it was perfectly normal Monday. I was uh, going to the, uh, the supermarket. I normally do that, so I can get some milk, I can get some bread. I was going to get some cat food. I got my cat food last week, six yeah, months ago. I'm not interested in your own personal shit. What I want to know is, what the fuck happened to those people in that oh, All right, well, I thought to myself, well, well, maybe I'll get myself a bit of fruit to try and make some sort of... Uh, okay, now we're getting some sort of right, regularity cool. happens. So I bought myself a bunch of bananas. We never had them in the war, you see. I would bring some bananas, yeah. something quite a bit luxury, really. Yeah, I don't yeah, know, yeah, I'm not going to have it. So uh, I got myself a bunch of fives. And actually, when we were young, we used to a bunch of fives. You kissed, that was quite familiar. Yeah, yeah, I remember yeah, thinking. Yeah, yeah. And then... Um, and then uh, Professor Gigantor jumped out. Oh God, not um, him. Yeah. The evil nemesis of... Of, of, of all the superheroes. Oh, yeah, the superheroes, yeah, 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 that's right, yeah. Um, Dr. Gigantor. Dr. Yeah, Gigantor like jumped out. out. I was, I just put it on, uh, taken one off of the box, I was about to eat it, and he pointed his gun at me, and I just held it up like that, and, and, and it just grew, and no one could the size of Dr. Gigantor created a giant banana. They came alive, they and, killed and, all those people and put them in the hole. And that's why I bought from Swindon's now under the, under the ground. God damn it, no. Oh my yeah, God. Yeah, now it was very upsetting. I, I can't believe the only one to see it, but I, I can't believe it fell away from Can me. I just ask, were these, uh, were these organic bananas? <laughs> they were fair trade. I don't know. Excuse me, excuse me. I see what he's been doing and all that for those rubbish to no gigantic car and all of what he called it. Oh, there's no respect for he, any realistic thing. He does stuff in his shed, this one. What? He's always experimenting in his shed. We will create the jack banana and killed everybody. He's lying to you. It's <laughs> <laughs> not my fault that I didn't have bananas when I was a kid because I was a little boy. Also, I should stuff behind the scenes in his shed. No, that's what happened these days. I'm no, 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 you're allowed to put the stuff, it doesn't have to be with another Is that why you bought the bananas to shove them up your ass? I bought four of the bananas and put in my house and one of them to eat because I was picky. What? <laughs> now let's get this straight because you, you, you put four bananas up your ass. No, I hadn't put them up, I was taking them home. You were taking them home to put them up your ass at home. But what yes. of the bananas went this way well after the fifth banana? Because just the fifth banana got turned into a jar. <laughs> <laughs> because they are experimentation. Oh, yeah. Why are you not telling them that? So I just thought I'd take some banana and crash all around into them. Is that so much a crime? No, it's a goddamn banana growth hormone. Did you put in that one banana for it to turn into a giant banana and kill half the people of fucking Swindon? Well, I can't afford new glasses. The script's got my attention. Okay, that's absolutely fantastic.
fantastic. Okay, there's the ground work laid out right there. He's been shoving bananas up his bum. He's made the bigger with golf hormone. Amazing. So it's time to break the story. Tom, you're going to stay the journalist. You are rushing back to your office. Chris, you are his editor. Now, you're going to tell Chris this story because you want it on the front page, but it's not going to be exciting enough for your editor. I want you two to make this story even more fantastic. Even more fantastic. Even more fantastic than a growth hormone banana that's been shoved up someone's bum and made massive. Um, every now and then, Eddie is going to run in as a new hound and interrupt you by telling you an absolutely ridiculous news story that's going on. So you've got to keep trying to make your banana story even better than his. Right. Or he'll get the front page, right. damn it! Okay, take it away. Hey! Oh my god, have I got the fucking scoop for you? Hey, come in, kid, sit down, what you got for me? I was in Swindon this morning. Swindon, yeah, yeah, I know what I've seen it all. I've seen it all. Like thousands of people were killed. The hell you said, kill, kill them, throw them into a giant pit. Whoa, this is good, I like this. What, what's this pit? What do, you, what do you mean? The pit was created just to die. Yeah, he'd been doing his shopping, right? And what's his name? What's this guy's name? Give me a name. Mr. Die. Mr. Die. That's right. That's cool. What's that? Somebody call him Gordon Guy. Gordon Guy, that sounds good. Gordon Guy, Gordon guy he been in his garden shed. He'd been experimenting with fruit, right? And he'd gone down with a... Chief, chief, chief. We oh, just, what is it, Jimmy? Yeah, we just found out what it is that people are wouldn't do for love. My God! Go get the soup on that right now! Go get the soup! That's gonna be page one of this number. Hey, hey, don't worry about meatloaf. This is, I love meatloaf, though. Come on, guy. He's found down with a local sort of ass that, yeah, 24 hours, and he's got himself a bunch of bananas, but they were too small, right? And he's gonna take four of them home and shoot them up and murder his ass. I'm right? his ass, you said. That's right, but that's why the buy. One of the bananas, he decided it wasn't big enough. So he took out some homemade growth serum that he'd been making in his own shed. Holy shit, some guy freaky scientist. That's right, yeah. this guy, the man, Gordon Guy. Is that his name? That was the name Gordon Guy, yeah, yeah. The man, Gordon Guy, yeah. He said he was Dr. Jack Hanno, you know, the bad guy that deals with all the superheroes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Chief, yeah. Chief, 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 yeah. yeah. The whole health organization was just admitted COVID was a joke. My God, that's the biggest story I've heard today. Stay with that one, I ain't on the other one. And listen, 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 you gotta listen. This, that story is even bigger because when he injected that last banana with a growth hormone, it turned into a giant fucking banana, came alive, and then it killed all the people in the Aster, smashed the Aster into a massive hole. My God, that is a good story. I like that. It's a good story. Okay, okay, we're gonna go with it. Wait a minute, Jimmy, Jimmy, yeah. Someone from the cast of Love Island has read a book. What? It's still out there. Oh, God! It's making its way from Swindon up north. It's on its way to Derby. It's gonna destroy Derby. Okay, we need a big title here. Watch out, there's gonna be a big title. Come on. Giant banana. Giant mutant. Giant banana. You know it's a mutant. It's already giant. You know that. Giant. Mutant. No, no, no. Giant, giant lab created mutant banana. You're adding more to it, but I like it. Okay. <laughs> giant mutated. No. Giant lab. Created new t oh, it's getting confusing. <laughs> Mutated <laughs> giant banana. Big banana kills people. Watch your fucking back. <laughs> we got it. We got the scoop. I love it. Let's do this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I love it too. Amazing. Thank you. Okay. That was it. Now, the story broke. It went worldwide. It's massive. It's time to make it into a movie. Oh, my God. We went there. It's time to see the casting process. So, um, Eddie, yeah. you are going to be a top Hollywood producer. <laughs> and Chris, you are going to be a top Hollywood director. And Tom, you are going to be every single person that they audition. <laughs> they are auditioning for the film Giant Banana Kills People, or whatever it is. You've not decided the title yet. You need to come up with that. And Tom is essentially everybody you want to see for the lead roles, male and female if you want to, Okay, I don't care. Um, for this movie, are you ready? Okay, take it away. Well, you can certainly get your fist out of my ass. I mean, you know, that's what it was that day. I mean, but that's just not how you say hello. It's how you say goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> come in, come in. Come in. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, it's my 
Excuse me, I'm not having space in. You were told you weren't allowed to come here anymore. <laughs> oh, out oh, you go. Oh, sorry about that. I'll live out. Oh, you will be sorry. Don't run away, but now, let me space here every time. Fucking spacey, always where he shouldn't be. Yeah. Anyway, who have we got happening? I, I don't know. They keep on coming in. But wait, could you wait? Could you wait until you're announced, please? <laughs> now, Fucking actors. I can't bear them. So. <laughs> We're going to so obviously uh, well, the character of Gordon Guy. Gordon Guy. It's Gordon Guy. Mm. He's an everyman. Mm-hmm. He's a <laughs> anal fetishist. <laughs> he is a <laughs> bananas. He's a monkey play. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> Are you trying to get the the orangutan from every which way but loose back again? I wish we could. I, I wish we really do. Um, now I've always thought we need someone older. Dick, Dignified, mm-hmm. I think Christopher Walken. Oh, Walken! Well, let's get him in. Let's get him to. We'll Walken. get him out of his cage. Uh, uh, Can you let Mr. Walken in, please? Thank you. Hello, it's uh, me, Christopher <laughs> Walken. <laughs> Crazy baby, welcome, Mark. welcome. Are you not feeling well today? <laughs> I'm Walken here. <laughs> okay, well, if you could uh, please uh, just go to uh, page thirty in the script. And uh, for the role of Gordon Guy. For the role of Gordon Guy. Yes, we'd like you. to hear. Um, we'd like to hear you. He's pottering around in his banana growth shed. We'd like to hear you uh, do the soliloquy from there. Yes. <laughs> bananas. <laughs> I like bananas. <laughs> Just hold you there. Very good. Continue. I want. I like putting bananas. In my ass for bananas at once. One, two, three. Okay, thank you. I mean, I think we've seen enough. I think, I think absolutely. Um, we'll let you know when you're coming back. So yeah, clear your diary. You're going to be in it. You're going to be in it. Thank you. I mean, I, I, like, I, I liked it. it. I liked it a lot. And he added the counting. I love that. I know. I know. It was, uh, it was like Sesame Street. <laughs> um, I. I think we need the uh, the neighbour. The neighbour, Elsie. Elsie, the neighbour. Yeah, we need Elsie, the neighbour. I am. I mean, Scarlett Johansson just refused. She is. A, I hate her. I <laughs> can't stand the twat. Yes. She <laughs> can we I, I think one of our great films. Can we get somebody a bit more dignified? I think more, you're right. A bit more grounded. Mm. I mean, Dame Judy's thing to mind, of course. Dame Judy, yes, I know, but. <laughs> Could we reanimate Thora Hurt? No, 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 no. silly <laughs> idea. Um, I'm going to say Mirren. Oh, Helmer. Helmer. Let's get her. Helmer. <laughs> Send in Helmer, please. Helmer, here we go. Oh, I mean that ends in straight. Hiya. Oh. It's me, Ellen Mirren. She is a <laughs> chameleon. Hi. Yeah, yeah, I'll give you, you what I need to tell you. Tell us that. You'll just come at the ass, man. That's right, Helen. She does. You know what they say about you, Helen? They always say you. Jim, I'm not smart. No, no, no. We insist. You can have a drink as well if you want. Oh, uh, you always prepare your work. I love that about yes, you, Helen. You're always prepared. So, um, well, neighbor. Let's, let's, I mean, uh, page 63. Do you mind, do you mind if I just pep myself up a little bit before? Yes, I... whenever you're ready, page 63, okay. in your own time, Helen. Okay, okay.
going to kill you, but it'll be proper bats.
That was beautiful, James. We're going to use that. My assistant director, Karen, didn't even know if you filmed this. It was an angry one. Okay. Um, now, this next scene is uh, where a uh, golden guy, he, he, the, the banana goes off, blows everything up, and he, we, want a, we want a monologue from you, Gordon. Okay. Uh, explain what's happened. And then, that's when uh, Helen and Short Time Shine, nosy neighbor comes in, and uh, you have uh, a slow motion fist fight. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's what the audience want. I know it didn't happen, but we're expanding the story. Okay, action. Maybe I'll just a hundred percent. Takes so much. 
You put too much in. But if the heart gets left out. <laughs> so your banana is not small enough, not big enough. Push it harder. <laughs> Use it sideways. <laughs> Ask a friend. <laughs> Reach out. Don't push in. <laughs> Otherwise, bananas will get bigger. Body counts will get higher. <laughs> None of us will feel satisfied. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay, that's a wrap up. Um, that's it. Gracias.